Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's Renee here. On today's video, I am dressing Madeline Bridgerton style and we are incorporating on Wednesdays we wear pink from Reborn Living Dolls over there, Shara. So we are going to be dressing Madeline here in some Bridgerton style dress. Now I don't know whether or not you guys watch Bridgerton or not, but on Bridgerton, in my eyes anyway, the girls dress in either two ways. Firstly, they dress in beautiful bright yellows and bright pinks and vibrant colors with all the jewels around their neck and in their ears and all their, their hair is up and beautiful. Or the Bridgerton girls dress in more of the subdued, elegant, the simplistic, elegant dress. Beautiful straight lined, very classy, pale blue, pale pink, um, creams, beiges. Uh, really, really the femininity is is huge in, their, in how they style themselves. And it's so... Um, just gorgeous the whole show is beautiful I love it I love everything that they wear on that show so today we are going to be dressing Madeline here like a Bridgerton girl um, and I hope you guys like the dress so I'm just taking off the outfit that she has been wearing since yesterday this is the twinning Tuesday outfit that I put on her for yesterday's video if you haven't seen that video pop on over and have a look I dressed her to twin with her sister Summer and we dressed in butterflies and we twinned in butterflies and we twinned in the same shades but different outfits so it's quite a cute video and I don't really talk much in that video I sped it right up so you guys could just watch the outfit change really um, some videos I love talking some videos I don't just depends on the day and, and on the video really so this little dress is covered in butterflies and it's quite cute um, you're going to sit back there, sweet girl. So I've got her lace stockings out for her to wear because on Bridgerton they all wear um, hosiery, of course, because they're elegant ladies on that show. Um, they wear long gloves, but I couldn't get any long gloves for Madeline. I don't know where you'd find long gloves up to the right up the arm for a two-year-old. <laughs> But, um, but she doesn't need long gloves anyway because her dress has long sleeves. Um, but yep, they all wear the hosiery. Now I just paused the video for a second there guys, but I'm back now because these tights of stockings are quite difficult to pop on and it is a bit of a struggle. So I didn't want you guys to see me struggling, but I just want to zoom up so you guys can have a look at the beautiful lace. Isn't that gorgeous? And I've got her some jewels for her hair and a string of pearls for her neck because no Bridgerton style is going to go without pearls and jewels. So we're going to pop those on as well. And I'm not quite sure how I'm going to be doing her hair just yet. I'll probably have to do that off camera and um, then come back on with her hair already done so that I don't waste your, your time too long on the video so I'm just going to unbutton this now I wanted to talk with you guys while I'm taking this outfit off of her about my puppies so my red toy poodle um, her name is Chershey she had um, just two days ago today's the second day yep she had puppies so she gave birth to three boys and one girl now what happened was during the birth she had the first boy and now I've been saying all along because my other white dog had five girls okay but with my red toy poodle I have always been saying I'm going to keep a girl from her this time to continue on with the breeding program that I'm doing so her last litter I regret because I didn't keep a little girl that I called Minnie um, she was absolutely gorgeous her temperament and the color of her and everything she was such a beautiful poodle I didn't keep her I sold her and I, I wanted to keep her but mm, I thought I'll wait for her next litter so these two litters my Bichon had five girls and I said to my husband we I'm probably jinxed now sure she's probably going to have all boys and I won't get to keep one and anyway her first um, puppy she had was of course a boy 
and then an hour later a second one came along and he was a boy as well and here is the outfit I'm going to be popping on her and then the third one was a girl <laughs> and then the fourth one was a boy so I was lucky I've got a little girl to keep which I'm going to showcase her on my channel as much as possible for you guys throughout the next few years and you can watch her grow up now here is the dress guys so um, that's the name of the dress it's so cute this dress I really love it because I do love birds um, I love birds on outfits and I can see this on one of the Bridgerton girls um, a long dress down to their ankles in this exact same print and fabric would look amazing so this is the dress so the top half of the dress going over the shoulders and down the arms is beige the material is linen and then it, it swerves up and the it is a baby pink like a pale pale pink and then it has look at this look at the birds guys one bird is flying another little bird is on a branch and the branches have got all pink and dark purple and green flat uh, leaves on there look at how gorgeous it is now, I don't have time to iron it otherwise I would but I'm going to put it on her unironed so please forgive me for that so I'm just going to um, take the tag off the dress and then we're going to pop it on her so yeah I was lucky to get my little girl poodle and we're going to name her Lulu so um, currently right now I'm just looking at her she's sleeping they're all sleeping her and her brothers and she's already I'm gonna to have to pause you for a sec to pop this over her head actually because it looks a bit small I'll just pause you okay we're back hmm it was really easy to get over her head actually guys oh look at the sleeves oh wow the sleeves have little eyelet buttons on the side there wow that is gorgeous let me zoom up so you can have a look so the sleeves are cream but then they have a white trimming and a cuff that opens up on the side of her arm with a little button that's so sweet this is what i love about arthur ab they always add these little intricate designs on their clothing which make them so individual to that particular store okay so let's just pop her arm this might be difficult to get her arm in there because the mealy sculpt's got really long arms so oh it was actually quite easy <laughs> i'm making myself look like a liar today on all these little things look her arm went in there so easy oh the sleeves are three quarter how gorgeous oh i love this dress it's very pretty Madeline's falling down you have to sit up properly Madeline there you go we'll just pop the other other arm in I think because the buttons open up you can really grab hold of their hand and pull their arm right through it's a great idea so the dress is lined as well of course and um, it's got a little button at the back of the nape and then it's got these two little buttons on the forearms it's very elegant and I love the colors and I love the lines on the dress okay guys we are back and I have now got Madeline all done up so I pinned her hair up into a Bridgerton style hairstyle it's pinned up beautifully with the Shirosky crystals up on her hair if you can see up there all of those are Shirosky crystals and she has the double string of pearls around her neck and now look at how gorgeous this dress is it's very pretty now don't forget she's only a two-year-old so this is the closest what I could probably find to a Bridgerton style dress for a two-year-old it's it's very elegant and look at that I love the color tone and the leaves on that branch the pale purple the bright purple and the bright pink 
it just adds a little bit of pop to the pale pink that it's sitting on top of and then you've got that cute little bird underneath Madeline's hand now my little princess is sitting quite elegantly now she's like mommy I'm going to cross my legs because now I'm a Bridgerton girl so she's sitting there with her lace stockings on with her legs crossed looking absolutely gorgeous look at her guys if you like her um, dress right now please give me a thumbs up um, and look at how beautiful she is if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you'd like to subscribe please subscribe and if you have a doll channel or any kind of um, crafting channel I will subscribe back to you as well because I love those things um, I love all kinds of dollies as you know if you watch my channel look at how beautiful she is I am loving this dress you look beautiful Madeline now I'm thinking about putting gold shoes on her feet uh, this dress would probably suit white shoes or gold or pale pink maybe but I think to go along with the elegance of her look I think some little gold shoes would look cute if you were going to a party you might want to put little heels little heels would look adorable so let's pop on her shoes so we are back now I have her ready I have her shoes on she's looking beautiful now I'm going to do this dress as a secret giveaway so if you've stayed to the end of this video right now you can write I'd like to win the dress and I'll know you've watched my entire video it is a secret I haven't mentioned it I'm mentioning it now have a great day guys bye guys